All right, welcome to this episode of my playthrough of Nier Automata. We are in the factory um, where uh, basically there's a group of machines that separate themselves from the network and set up a, um, a settlement similar to Pascal's village. And they'd reached out to Pascal uh, to negotiate peace and form some sort of an alliance. Um, we got there. They've got a very religious bent to them. They said uh, they want to become as gods. Um or at least half of them want to become as gods by killing everything. By ki by dying, you become as gods, and they want to kill everyone, including themselves. And uh, that that was fun. <laughs> so we've been trying to escape from them, but only half of them have been going crazy. Now we got here. We're near the exit. Uh, the music has gone quiet, uh, and this shuddering machine over in the corner here uh, said, "He killed them. He killed them all." Now we've killed. Adam, who we know is responsible for half of the machine network. Uh, we have not killed Eve, who we presume is responsible for the other half of the machine network. Only half of the machines are going crazy. This machine's saying, he killed them all. I have a funny feeling we're about to encounter Eve. Uh, so let's see if I'm right, all right? Yeah, corridor filled with bodies with a big empty door. At the end of a long escape, makes me think this. And uh, oh, big empty round thing. <laughs> yeah, this is this is gonna be a boss battle for sure. Over fire, no less. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna leave that corpse there because I get the feeling I'm gonna need the a companion for this battle. Th two more corpses. Not Eve. Alert. Energy shield detected over enemy unit. Physical defense shield detected. Analysis. Both long and close range attacks are ineffective. Oh, now what? Large energy supply detected within this factory. Proposal. Energy source should be destroyed. 9S. That Goliath we just encountered. I got it. I've been keeping an eye on you. I'm going to shut off power to the factory now. Do it. Factory system at 80% control. A scared girl saw swaying Flora in the deepest darkness. Hang in there, 2B. 90%. 92. 95. 98. Well, that companion didn't last long. I just shut down the electrical grid. Enemy shield deactivated. A dreamy child saw a black book at, in a city of burning of building blocks. Yeah. Well, these companions don't last very long at, at all. An animal loving android was careless at the capital of junk. the shockwaves. Oh. 
seems like it is currently impermeable. Oh, there we go. I was kind of half expecting uh, Pascal to say something here. Uh, unit data has been updated. Because of course it has. Special unit machine. A multi-legged Goliath-class machine life form equipped with two massive blades. Uh, by emitting energy from the tips of its legs, it can move about as though gliding across the ground. The unit sides serve as weapon racks that can launch missiles and other projectiles. While well, additional plating attached to the legs reinforces its weak armor. When the situation demands it, the, the unit can purge this plating and transform into a spherical form capable of spin attacks. That's the way we want to go. That's the way we came. this elevator that we came out of. Creepy as hell. These guys are all in individual cages. They're just kind of bashing the crap out of the other, whatever the other thing is in the cage. I want to talk to this one, but I can't. This factory is eerily quiet right now because the power has been shut off, of course. They just all committed suicide. That's not cool. Lone Lancer saw old companions inside an empty ship. You know, however this game started, and 
It started pretty dark. It got hella dark. In theme, in tone, this game is dark. As I was saying, this game is dark, and I kind of love it. And I still have absolutely no access to those locked chests. back to the resistance camp. What about you? Oh, I'll probably wander back to the village. I have plenty on my plate there. I see. Bye-bye, Pascal. This is the resistance camp. Say again? I'm not receiving. Scanning for interference. The machine requesting a backup. Forces in range. Please, we can... Let's move. Ah, uh, I bet Eve has decided to attack the uh, resistance camp. But after that ordeal, I think a save is in order. So it looks like I was kind of half right. Eve was responsible for um, for the kind of the craziness, but uh, he wasn't the uh, the battle the boss battle I was uh, uh, I was going to encounter at the end of the factory. I thought I was going to have to fight Eve. Oh, these guys are aggressive. Ah, no. Don't attack the, uh, don't attack the, oh! Those guys had, like, skull faces, incomplete heads. That's kind of disturbing. Uh, I, why do I get the feeling this is, a uh, an instance of, uh, infinite enemy spawning? I guess not infinite en enemy spawning. Just lots of enemy spawning. Including Goliaths, apparently. A 
Look at how many black dots there are on the map. That is gonna be fun as hell. Why are their numbers increasing like this? Cause unknown. Try contacting the bunker via laser relay system. Affirmative. Well, 2B and the pod may not know, but I think we do. And I'm getting unit data updates, so there's these, it's apparently counting these as uh, new machines. Something tells me that what's actually going on is that Eve has gone crazy due to the, due to the loss of Adam, and um, his derangement is uh, seeping into um, all of the machines under his control through the network. So, like, his unhinged nature is manifesting in these literally unhinged machines. Alright, let's take a look at unit data, standard machines, what's the standard machine that I got here. Rampaging small stubby. Oh yeah, look at that thing's face, it's creepy. A machine life form that has become violent after infection by Eve will attempt to attack androids as if they were prey. The armor plating on his head has been removed, revealing teeth-like metal pipes that nevertheless have no functionality as a mouth. It is theorized that either this modification was implemented due to self-optimization, or that possibly some alien race created them in likeness to themselves, though neither of these are proven. Rampaging small biped. Uh, same description. Rampaging medium biped, same description. Special unit machine. Uh, the machine life forms who formed a colony in the abandoned factory worship this particular unit as their founder. He has since ceased to function, which his followers take as proof he became a god. So I, I never actually fought that guy. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Another Goliath dropped. I want to take on this medium flyer, these medium flyers though. I'm curious if that counts as a rampaging medium flyer. No, it does not look like it. It looks like it's just uh, another medium flyer. Alright, so these guys look like they're basically endlessly replenishing, so I am going to head over to the resistance camp.
No! Well, that's dark and disturbing. At least the flowers are still here. To be you okay? They came out of nowhere, overran the entire camp. We tried to fight back, but our shots have no effect. Alert. Energy shields detected on multiple enemy fighters. Physical attacks recommended. Got it. You get the other androids out of here. Good luck. Oh, hello, Goliath. Talk to the resistance leader. All right, let's do a quick check to see if I got any new unit data. No, nope, doesn't look like it. I've encountered all of those guys before. To be, you, you saved our lives. What's going on here? I have no idea. They came out of nowhere and just... Huh? That was outside the camp! Uh, investigate the area around the camp. Alright. Proposal. Return to the operational area immediately. Well, I guess I can't go into my room. I guess I can't talk to that android. Oh, this is gonna be big. You again? Do you notice how the, all the water is glimmering? This means I am not going in the water. Destroy the Goliath. 
You don't say. Thing I landed that direct hit. Huh? Uh oh. You'll die. All of you are going to die. <laughs> uh, what? To me. You okay? I'm fine. Let's take this bastard down. Right. Unit data has been updated. Okay, now I'm curious. Uh. So, very similar. Equipped with an offensive firearm unit, this long-range menace can also emit electricity from the tips of its legs, turning nearby water-covered surfaces into danger zones. So, it's not the entry for Eve like I thought it was. So it looks like I basically have to take his shield away from him. Oh, holy jeez. Wow. They're still... coming? What do we do? There's too many. Chubby? Chubby, can you hear me? Our village is under... Pascal? Come in, Pascal! Shit! Yeah, this is beginning to feel an awful lot like, uh, like the end of a game. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, this is, uh, this is a thing. Alright, I'm gonna call an end to the episode there. You know the drill, click over there. Join me next time as we go in. I, I think we're gonna try and save Pascal from Eve and, uh, whatever else he's doing. So, uh, see you then. <laughs>